After soccer practice in June 2018, 12 members of a Thai soccer team, along with their coach, decided to explore nearby Tam Luong Cave, one of Thailand's longest caves. The boys, aged 11 to 16, and their 25-year-old coach waded into the waters and began exploring the cave. When a flash flood came, they pushed deeper in, eventually making their way to an elevated platform four kilometers into the cave system. The flood filled the twisted cave system with water, trapping the boys for 17 days. For the first nine days, they had no food. The coach, a former Buddhist monk, had the boys meditate, drink water dripping from the stalagmites. He knew that the water on the floor had too much residue to drink, but the water dripping from stalagmites is relatively clean. It even includes some nutrition, including iron and minerals, which played a key role in the survival of the boys. But surviving that long was only half the battle. There was no way to get the boys out without sedation, as they became too weak, and some parts of the cave were so narrow that it might cause them a claustrophobic panic attack. The boys were sedated, given a full face diving mask, and carried out by swimming back for hours through exceedingly tight squeezes. Thanks to the efforts of Thai Navy SEALs and the international dive community, all survived and were able to quickly return to a normal, healthy life after the rescue. But tragically, one former Thai Navy SEAL died in the rescue effort.